Hi there. So I think most people would agree that ArcGIS Pro is the industry standard in terms of commercial GIS packages. But one of the downsides is that it comes with a pretty hefty price tag. So if you're here in the UK, then a commercial license for GIS Professional Advanced is going to run you in excess of five and a half thousand pounds. And even a personal use license is well over a hundred pounds. And if you're a student or you're brushing up for job interviews, then you might not have that cash sitting around in your bank account. I mean, some would argue it's a fair price given the range of functionality and the dozens of um, toolboxes that ArcGIS Pro can, can come with, although some of those do come at an extra cost themselves. So what are the options that you've got if you want to brush up on your ArcGIS Pro skills and you've not got a license at the moment? So the first thing you can do is take a look at their free trial program. Um, now, it's really easy. You go on, search ArcGIS Pro free trial on Google and it will pop up with a 21 day free trial. You can sign up. Um, now, if you're watching this video, there's a reasonable chance you might have done that already. And while 21 days is great, if you do want to just brush up on skills, you've got an interview coming up, you've not used ArcGIS Pro for a while, um, then that's fantastic. And it does come in two flavors, one for GIS professionals um, and one for GIS students. But 21 days definitely isn't enough if you want to really get to grips with learning the software and its full capabilities. One thing you can try if you're a student and you've got an ArcGIS online account from your college or university is actually download the ArcGIS Pro free trial and make sure you've logged in with your institutional account because actually a lot of colleges and universities will also get ArcGIS Pro licenses um, as part of their package. And what you might discover is actually if you log in with your school account actually you've already got an ArcGIS Pro license assigned to you. And if that's the case, then actually your free trial software will recognize that and actually become a full version registered with your, your university license. So that's worth a go. But obviously if that doesn't work or if you're not a student, what can you do to get more than 21 days? So actually there is one simple um, and completely legit way of doing this. So I'm not going to promote any kind of hacks, cracks or other dubious means of, of getting a longer license. But probably the easiest way to get the full version of ArcGIS Pro plus a bunch of other stuff um, without paying a penny is to sign up for Esri's MOOC program. So MOOC stands for Massively Open Online Course. And if you just Google Esri MOOC or go to esri.com slash training slash MOOC. Um, it'll bring you to this page here and you'll see they've actually got a great program of open online courses starting up every kind of month or two most of the time. So I'm currently taking the uh, AEC projects with GIS and BIM MOOC because that's something I've not done for a while. Um, you can see I've actually taken the spatial data science one previously and I, I highly recommend it. But one of the, the big advantages of these, if we click into the next one to, to start, which is the Spatial Data Science MOOC, is you can see the course topics, you can see when it runs, um, but you'll see down here in terms of software, Esri provides free access to ArcGIS Pro, ArcGIS Online, ArcGIS Notebooks, ArcGIS Spatial Analyst, and ArcGIS Image Analyst software during the course. So actually just by signing up for the MOOC, you'll get given a license to use all of this software for free for the duration of the course. And actually, in this case, that runs for six weeks, which is twice the length of the, the standard free ArcGIS Pro license. And obviously, you don't just have to sign up for one of these things. So sign up for the MOOC. I'd recommend doing the course, but actually, in the meantime, you've got that software there to practice on and to hone your GIS skills. And when that runs out, simply sign up for the next course that's coming up and get another six week um, free license. Now, there might be gaps in between, so I can't promise that you're always gonna be able to have an ArcGIS license for this. And frankly, you know, if you're, if you're needing it for more than a few months, then maybe you should start to, to look into one of the, the paid for options. But 
If you want a, a legitimate free ArcGIS Pro license, then this is the best way to go about it. Sign up for some of the MOOCs, they're fantastic courses, they cover some great topics, and you can make use of the extra time to brush up on your ArcGIS skills. If you do need longer and you're still not, not able to splash out on a license, maybe it's time that you start spreading your wings and thinking about some of the great open source options that are out there and maybe check out some of my videos on QGIS um, and the GIS capabilities that it can give you. But hopefully that was useful um, and hopefully that will help some of you out there get an ArcGIS Pro license and be able to brush up on your skills and kickstart your, your GIS career. So thanks a lot. Please do like and subscribe.